Hey guys, Courtney Cox here in the PNC Bank Sports Corner, joined with Doug Kide. We've got Cam Newton news today. We also have a little bit of Tom Brady news today. Apparently he is signing a contract extension through the 2022 season. We all saw this coming, right? Yeah, I mean, this creates some salary cap room for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. To me, this is Tom Brady just continuing to help out his teams. He did it for years by signing mid-market, below-market salaries with the Patriots. We'll see what that 2022 figure does uh, for the Bucs, how high that is. But I was even just looking at quarterback contracts the other day. Tom Brady signed a two-year, $50 million deal with the Buccaneers last offseason. And when you have guys like Dak Prescott signing a market deal at $40 million per season, Tom Brady is still absolutely one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL. He might also still be one of the best bargains in the NFL as well, if that is right in line with what he'll make in 2022 as well. What does this do for his kind of uh, cast around him, if you will, his, his targets, his weapons? Do you think that they add to that because he signs this deal through 2022? Or do you think they work with the guys that they've got? I think it's probably based around keeping the band back together. Uh, they already re-signed Levante David. I think they're, they're, they franchise Chris Godwin. So this would be a hopes of reaching a long-term deal with him as well. We'll see what they do with Antonio Brown and Rob Gronkowski, but this certainly does free up that cap space for them to be able to bring those guys back. And you know that Tom Brady wants Antonio Brown back. He wants Rob Gronkowski back. I think there was a report that he wants Odell Beckham too. So, you know, this could even create the cap space for something bigger to come down the line there as well. And this is what, I mean, Tom Brady's in an advantageous spot right now with the Buccaneers with all of those weapons around him. And you can see why he would want to free up that cap space to make them, you know, favorites again in 2021 and beyond. Well, Tampa Bay continuing to roll. So make sure to tweet at Doug and myself. Be nice because the Twitter fear on a Friday just is too much uh, about what you think. Is Tom Brady going to repeat? Is he going to build a dynasty down itself? Should be interesting for 2021 season. Doug, thanks so much for joining me.